How much do I weigh? I don't know, 100 and this looks like 175-ish. Hi, Luna, guess what time it is. What is that device? Seems like I'm walking away from you now. <laughs> Come here, babes. Come on, baby. She just thinks she probably thinks you're taking her back up. You know what, Trey? Yeah. Sus. Like, yeah. I'd be sus. I'd be sus for me too. <laughs> uh, oh, Luna, come here. It's a treat. Baby, come here. Come here. Oh my God. This is actually really cute. Can you sit down for me? <laughs> she yoinked and took off. Is she a mind reader right now? Yeah, but this isn't bad. This, this is, is not even a bad thing. This is adorable. Hey, where'd you go? Come here. Come on. Come on out. Come here. Hey. Sit. No, uh, uh, uh. Luna. my treat. Luna. <laughs> she doesn't want to be with me. All right, we'll get back to you as soon as my dog stops freaking out. Luna is very suspicious. We just want to pick her up so we can weigh her. It's not even a big deal, Luna. Here. What do you want me to like? One, two, three, four, and up. How heavy does she feel? Well, I bet she's about 60 pounds. Okay. She did not want this to happen. Let's see. You're at about 2.30. Wait, get off my head. You're putting weight on my head. Yeah, it's about 2.31. 2.31. Okay. So math that. Ugh. <laughs> Oops. We're in central Minnesota. Why is a torta cubana with fries? I don't know how I'm gonna eat this. We spoiled ourselves a little bit today. There's more carbs than I eat in a week in this month. Look at Torta Cubana. And Luna got a bully stick. Our little pond looks like just a very large puddle right now. I assume there's nothing living in here. I think it freezes solid. But I expect maybe frogs? We've already started to hear frogs. Are we just gonna stand here? Apparently. She found her little horn. on a test drive in the middle of Minnesota on the solar day of the solar eclipse. What? It's the shirt for me. I don't care about the shirt. Because uh... I'm doing plumbing today. Today's episode is a guy who has never really done plumbing tries to do some plumbing. So let me show you what's going on in here. This is uh, the back room that we've all been in before and trust me, I know that when we make a video about this nobody watches it. Whatever. Anyway, I've been working on this before. We've had this sump pump in and out. And we thought that we might try and bring this old water softener back to life. I don't know when it's from. It, it's probably, I don't know. If anybody knows anything about water softeners, feel free to comment. This is in where it's older than God. Um, we were dumb enough to put salt in it. <laughs> and it started leaking immediately. And it's been leaking and it's been setting the sump pump off pretty regularly every like 20 minutes for way too long. And I've been putting it off because this is not my specialty and I don't know what I'm doing. And so, of course, I went to a hardware store and didn't ask for help and bought a bunch of pipe fittings and now we're gonna see if they fit and work for what I'm trying to do. I got a bunch of stuff making noise. I got all the water off, so this is just slightly terrifying. Oh, it's, is there something draining out of there? No. No, it's like air bubbles, basically. The heck? Air bubbles. There's not much maneuverability with this thing. All kinds of things happen All here. All kinds of things make a noise, man. There's not much water leaking on the ground. Here. Until now. No, I know. <laughs> what is that? I mean, if I start freaking out, I'll start screwing it back in, but so far... Oh my god, the sounds that this thing is making. It's not even leaking anymore. It's making me nervous for sure, but I know nothing about what's going on right now. Well, the line that makes me nervous is this line because there's no shut off for it and it's the feed for everything many hours later 
Hell yeah, you say. So we waited all day for this to pull us off of here because I was afraid that it was hot water and really spewing out of there. All that noise that we heard in there was just that it was like filling full of air. Luckily, there was, there was very minimal spillage in here. Screw it back into this manifold. Yeah. And then we're going to save up our nickels until we can afford a new one. It is a gorgeous day and we decided to come to Lowe's and start our project. Time to start gardening now that the snow is finally melting and everything. And we have a bunch of free pallets that I'm going to use for the fence material, but we still need like fence posts and we don't have any seeds. So we're going to start our seed bank. We don't have everything we want, but nothing so expensive here. Uh huh. Just gonna get started a little bit. Topsoil, topsoil. There's so many different kinds. Cow manure and compost. I'm gonna keep looking down here. Hold on. It's the start of my gardening empire. <laughs> I can't wait to get it all built. Soon. <laughs> 